I want to reiterate to what Professor Kindiki has said. Those of us who have been given an opportunity to serve under this national security organ framework, we are comrades, we are partners, we are brothers and sisters, and we call upon all of you that we have one mandate provided in the Constitution to protect and defend our country and the citizens and to provide security and stability for the social economic development of our country to be attained and for institutions like the National Police Service and Kenya and that, that the Kenya Prison Service falls under is to maintain that the rule of law is anchored among our citizens. So we want to ask each and every member of the security organs, the Kenya Defense Forces, the National Intelligence Service, and the National Police Service, those three organs, and the many, many other formations that are below them, that at all times, let our focus be that of comradeship, be that of uniting our country and defending the citizens and their property and the sovereignty and territorial integrity of our nation and work together when we are called upon to offer civil duty during the times of disaster, during the time of floods, we will, call, will be called upon by the constitution and by the command structure to come to the help of our citizens and our country. The establishment of this facility is a, is a testament to our government commitment in providing quality health care services to all its citizens, including those who serve in our national security agencies. This initiative is part of a broader health care program aimed at ensuring 
access to essential medical service. Our notable institutions under this program include the National Police Service Hospital along the Bagathi Way, which me and my brother, Minister Kindiki, will visit later today, and the Forces Referral and Research Hospital, which is under construction, level six, under construction uh, in Kabat, Kabete Barracks. And that is a hospital, the level six, that will become a regional referral hospital, not only for our security organs and our citizens, but for our regional partners and allies in the security sector. The construction of this hospital, we are going to have some way where members of the public around here, even if it's on a referral uh, basis, can get some access to um, this facility because this facility is primarily for ourselves, but also we want to build good, um, a good rapport and trust with the surrounding uh, community. And that is going to be our policy even for the other institutions, including the National Police Service Hospital, which will be uh, also taking over today. So because within the security sector, we are one unit. We are united. We have different mandates. But our common objective that puts us together is the security and stability of our nation. And therefore, the organs of internal security and our Kenya Defense Forces that are responsible for the defense of our nation, we have one common objective. And therefore, we must always work together whenever there is an opportunity. And therefore, we felt KDF, therefore, is the natural um, a partner for Kenya Prison Service. And I'm very delighted at the very, very cordial, warm, and friendly um, engagement that has taken place during the construction of this facility.